Welcome to the Scott Martin Challenge, guys. We've got a great show for you today. A little 2v2 action. Guggen Squad is officially in the house, guys. Myself and Justin Rackley are going to be team one. We're going to be going against Mike One Rod and Christian Greco. I can tell you what, these guys know how to fish. We got a little side bet going on. Stay tuned. This show is going to be action packed. I'm thinking, I'm thinking like, it's the land of the unknown, right? Yeah. I mean, like, I've never been here. Oh, yeah. never I heard it's here. good. <laughs> we don't know yet. But it's like 150 acres of just elaborate of stuff. Well, I mean, we pulled up, came down this Juicy. dirt road. I mean, it looks like nobody's ever really fished here before. It looks like the right kind of stuff. So it looks like there's going to be some big ones in here, uh, It's hopefully. a flipping day. It's a frogging day. It's, a, it's, probably, it's a probably everything day. So all I know is we got a little challenge today. And I'm so excited about this. Just and I have hung out quite a bit. This is the first time you've been on the TV show, Mike. Yep. Thank we you. got Christian, first time on the TV show. So we're going to do a little SMC beat down today. I think just keep it simple, right? I mean, five fish, Best tournament five. tournament deal. Right. Me and you yep. got to get ready for the tournament <laughs> scene anyways. Absolutely. Keep our biggest one, a little bragging rights. What do you think? Sounds good to yeah, me. We're Sounds down. good. Get All right, dude. Kitchen. Best of luck. Best of luck, right. guys. Good luck, gentlemen. Look, dude, you gonna dude, win it. dude we go. Get, I think we got a mic. And, and the <laughs> yeah. best part, the best part about putting Mike in that boat is if they actually get on a good spot, we're gonna know where it is. <laughs> we're gonna hear him screaming. Yeah. We're gonna be like, oh yeah, go that way. Yeah. All right, boys. Sorry. We'll see you back here this afternoon. All right. Well, what do you think, Mike? You think we give it, give it some flipping action to, to start things off? Hey, try to go after a big one first thing, or what are you thinking? So what I'm thinking. We need a team effort here. You, your flipping skills are second to none. I don't want to be flipping behind you. I'm not going to catch anything. <laughs> so I'm thinking I'm going to go for the numbers with a spinner bait. Okay. You go for numbers the, and or big ones, big flipping. ones flipping. So we'll, we'll run the bottom of the water column. I'll run the middle and uh, we'll try to get that quick five and then we'll try to upgrade from there. Let's do it, let's do it. A lot of these lakes in Central Florida, they're all old phosphate pits. And so they have that, that, that mineral and they have that green. This is cleared up quite a bit though from some of the lakes, but this has got, I like the color a lot. Usually it's like that brown tannic. Yes. Look, this is mm -hmm. totally different than what yep. I fished in Florida. Oh look, dude, I've got map. In oh here, my gosh. I got map. Do you have here. a map of this place? I got map in here. Yeah, look at these. Oh floaters. look at these. Look at these. Some look at floaters. these pigs. Yep. Oh. Yep. Gave it a look. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think that fish will chase a dirt bait. I got an Alabama rig in here. Oh yeah, that would that would be dangerous. I would have never thought that <laughs> we're out here. We have no rules right now. So right here, I'm running the Zinger. Favorite bait in windy conditions, but now this is like a Zinger on steroids. I've added the Happy Trailer. It's gonna add a little bulk and it's gonna add a ton of action to the back in addition to the skirt. This right here is a big fish catcher. That's what we're gonna need if we're gonna take down LFG and Scott Martin. Oh, that's a big oh, that's one. That's a big too. one. It's a that's big, big one, Mike. It's what a, what it's do I do? A giant Wait, one. Am I, do I got him this? pinned up. You're going to have to grab him. You're going to have to grab him. That's a giant one, Mike. I got him pinned oh, up. Oh, I got him pinned up. There. Grab him. Grab him. There we go. That's a big one. Oh, my gosh. Look at that one. How about that one? It's number one. That is an absolute giant. Oh, my gosh. Look how fat that fish is. I think the unknown is a little more known. We might be in the land of giants today. No how big is that? Is that a six and a half or what? That's at least a six pound Look at the fish. belly. Look how fat he is. Is this a wow. pre-spawn fish? Is, what are we yeah, looking at is, here? I think this is a pre-spawn fish just Woo! all full of bait. Wow. Boys, you might be in trouble. <laughs> Come on, okay. That's a big one. That is a big one. That is a big one. <laughs> we can get four more of those. We're going to be looking at a, a huge <laughs> bag of fish here. <laughs> all I can say is, Scott, LFG, good luck, uh, good luck good beating luck, us guys. today. <laughs> yeah, there was a giant one. He kind of looked at it. He kind of, there he is. Little one. Nice. Just a little bank runner. First blood. First blood. All right. 140. 140. 140. Got to start somewhere. Start somewhere. Can only go up from here. That's right. There he is. Mm. 
back, no, back two. up, back up. We got a 140, probably a 135. Dang, Scott, you are a veteran. 136. <laughs> Damn, off by just a little bit though. Okay. <laughs> We still haven't caught up to the one they caught this yeah, morning. Yeah, yeah. Two, two fish not equal in their one. Sorry, we just started, but we just got on the right kind of bank. Oh, oh, like a smack. Oh, you, came back. You come oh, back came for it? Twice, twice in a row. Come on. Oh, I got him. Oh, you got oh, him. You got crappie. him. You got him. A big. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Hey, Look I guess, at that crappie. I guess we know what those bass are eating. <laughs> They're eating those big Jeez. crappie. That is a huge one. Oh, well, I'm not helping the team quite yet, but uh, <laughs> at least I've got the skunk off the boat. Nice crappie. LFG, you probably could be a little jealous. This would be a nice little fish sandwich right here, but let her go. Oh. All right. Coming at us. <laughs> well, I mean, he was really out there. Oh, I got one. I had one too. <laughs> We're on a school. Oh my gosh, dude. That was a little bigger. It's a two. That one will measure. Yes. We're in the game with that one. Dude, I literally was looking at you and my rod took off. Two, ah, 206. 206. Good, I'm glad I was wrong. Woo! Had, Good job, uh, dude. Yeah. The other bank had a lot of marsh out before it got to the bank. Here, you have the bank, and this time of the year, these fish are thinking about spawning shortly, and so they want to be where the bank is. They can they can spawn there, they can, they can chase bluegill there. It's a better deal. So these banks with a little dirt behind them are, is going to be the key. Oh, sheesh. There's a big one. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go. Oh. Got him. Need a little I got him. assistance. You've, I got you've done him. this before. I trust you. I got him. Yes, there go. sir. There we go. Dude, I don't know what that meant, that bite, but he it wasn't even on the bottom. He was just sitting under the boat. Like, literally, he said something to me, and I was I had off the bottom and went boom. I, I bet he just followed it out. Like, <laughs> saw it up in there and just said, I need it. I need it in my face. I need it. I need it. I need it bad. That's a good one right there. Bug is the truck. Uh, and, I, and I switched to a bandito bug. All right. My favorite one. 364. Uh -huh. 364. Confirmed. All right. Good fish. We'll stick it in the box as our big one so far. So it's interesting what we figured out. So, you know, again, the, the, where we started had a lot of a lot of distance between the outside edge and the shoreline. And we came over here and, and this is just a better bank where you got a little, little dirt, a little sand. I start off with a nuke punch, which is a great bait. It has a uh, you know, nice wide body. I switched, I cut that big one on the bandito bug. And I think this is gonna be probably key for us today is the bandito bug. He just switched to the lizard. The more action, the better. Lakes like this where there's a lot of population, just something to trigger those fish a little bit better. And I'm hoping this little dude right here. It glides a little better as well. Kind of just takes its time to get down through there. So you can flip a heavier weight, but it slows that bait fall down just a smidgen. And uh, it's absolutely my favorite one, so. Got him, oh, got, got him. him. Got him that time. How's he feeling? He's running you at me. A good one? Oh, that's it's a big bad. one. Oh, yeah. wow, we need wow, this wow, one. wow, wow. Do I flip him or do no, you? No, 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 no. Oh, oh yeah, that's good. All right, here we go, here we go. I'll right. bring him to you. All right, all right. I got Let's him. go! There, we go. there you go, Mike. That's on a good On the spinner fish. bait. On the spinner bait. So they will come out on that edge and yeah. eat the spinner bait. I missed a couple bites. Nice. And finally landed one. This one, not the fat beast that you caught. Yeah, but, but that's a solid fish yeah. right there. Maybe two and a half, a little more than I that. I think he'll go over two and a half. I think he's probably in the three pound range. Put it on the scale. Let's get the scale on it. I wonder how Scott and LFG are doing. <laughs> All right, come on. Oh yeah. Three pounds, 11 ounces. Wow, that's, there you go. that's thicker than I thought. Yeah. Let's see if we can get two more and then we'll be feeling uh, yeah, much we'll be better feeling for the challenge. Good. You got any happy trailers in this boat, bro? Yeah, there was a couple in here. There's oh, you gone? Yep. Is it big? It's, I think it's a decent size. Oh, yeah, yeah it's, it's big. big. You flipping her? I'm going to flip her. I'm going to flip yeah, her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got this, bro. Come on. Whoa! Oh, my gosh, <laughs> dude. You're catching the absolute mondo. <laughs> Look at that one. Whoa, she <laughs> swallowed it. Yeah, she had that Dang. bait down there deep. Look at that yeah. on that nuke punch. Nice job. There we go. Here, let me yep, clean get her up. a little bit of that. Yep, yep. Got her. Got her. Yeah. Got her deep. We'll see what this one goes. Yep. Dude. I mean, that's got to be I think that's almost. Five pounds, yeah, dude. I mean, it's long, though. It's long. I, I think it's close to six. Five pounds. Ten, ten ounces. Ten ounces. Just over five, five and a half. Ten. We're gonna Woo. Get, get her back in the water. Yep. Yeah, get her back in the water. She's bleeding a little bit. Yep. She she ate that nuke punch. 
You didn't gut hook her. The only no, thing you did was, is you just nicked her. Just in you, the gill you nicked the gills bit. a little bit yep. with the hook. So so. It's just gonna bleed. Open. That yeah. fish will definitely live though. Get that one back. She'll be good to go. Yeah. Get her back in the water. Let's right away. go, bro. That's number four. Go. That is uh, four fish. Yep. <laughs> We've got 16 pounds on four fish. <laughs> <laughs> this is shaping up to be a good day. This is going to be fun. I think we should go for 25. I think so. I think we, I think we, I say we go for 30. 30? Hey, dirty 30. 30 30. Pounds. Dirty Let's 30. Do it, baby. Let's do it. Oh, come on, That's baby. A There's a little better. The one. That's a little better. There. Yes. Yeah. I want a point. There she is. <laughs> Hello, darling. Choked it. Just absolute choke it. Scott, I think you had three more with it. Did you see a bunch cruising out? Yeah, there's a team. <laughs> there's a team in there. The best part about today so far is just figuring it out. That's, you know, that's what I love the most about fishing is when, you know, you, you kind of you know, don't catch them at first and you make an adjustment and then it works. 250. 250. 250. And then it works. That's like the most satisfying thing ever. Also nice when you call your shot. That one's yeah. big and it ain't it. Oh yeah! Coming out oh. Oh. <laughs> oh yes, we need that one. Oh. No! Oh, dude! Yes! Dude! There's another one. Heck yeah! This thing ain't even turned off yet. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Oh, that one's big too. A little belly. 394. 394. 394. Daddy. Let's, let's keep that one in the box. Wind laid down a little bit. Yeah. That's probably perfect timing to put down the spinnerbait, huh? Yep. If I catch one fish behind you, I'm going to be proud of myself. <laughs> got him? Yep, got and one. Oh, yeah, wow, it's good. a big one. It's good. That's definitely going to help us. Bro, flip it, go. it up. You're let's go. It in. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. In the flipping action. There we That's go. That's the fifth fish we needed right there. <laughs> Definitely right about that flipping call. Good yeah, job, look at man. that hook right through the top, yep. too, on this and lizard. You, and you know what? Someone caught this fish before. I don't, it might have been Scott's dad out here. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it was Bill Dance. Who knows? Perfect hook set right in the top. That scale out for me. Nice. Maybe four? Maybe? Yeah, I think he'll go. I think he'll go probably close to four. Let's see. Just three An pounds, ounce under 15 four, ounces. Three pounds, 15 ounces. We will take that. All day. For our fifth fish. Now we got to upgrade. I upgrade think we got one time. little one we that we got one little one. We got one one pounder in there to upgrade. And uh, the way they're biting, I think we're gonna make it happen. <laughs> I love Florida. Love grubs, little uh, real compact bait. It's a great jig trailer. You know, perfect for swim jigs or flipping jigs, whatever you want to do with it. But it's very compact, so gives them a little little tasty treat. Nice. Not too intimidating. You don't want? Just keep in your pocket, just in case. Oh, hang on, hang on. They still like the bandito oh! bug. Oh! They still like the bandito bug. They can never refuse the bandito. <laughs> I'll keep them out. Uh, there he is. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, yeah, that's a good one, though. Better. That's a good one. Just bring him right in here. God. Bring him right in here. There we go. Man, I thought that was it. Right there, man. <laughs> this was mean. Dude, they are powerful here. Right there. I don't think he's gonna help no, us, dude. No, he's gonna help. But. A lot of these fish, you would think, would just be up in the cover. Like we would, you would think that most of them we we would catch would be up in, and we're not. We're actually they're suspended out here. They're like out in front of things, and I'm not. It, it's weird. I'm not real sure why they're doing that, like they are. But but they are. It's real obvious. It's like the amount of fish that we catch in it is way less than the amount of fish we catch just pitching around out here and, and nothing. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's a pretty good fish, stuff. too. Is that going to help us? To get yeah, I think it will. Yeah, let's get close. Can Just get in there? Yeah, I think that, oh, he's stuck. I'm going to grab him. That's going to help us a little bit. Oh, yes, sir. Woo, I, th I threw it way back in the oh, jungle. Oh, he came off, oh, too, came once off. I oh, grabbed him. Oh, perfect. Dude, good save. <laughs> nice. That was definitely going to help us out. That's there probably about three. Yeah, that might be close to three. That'll help us out a little bit. Yeah, let me see if I can't. Let's get unstuck, and I'll, I'll weigh him up yeah. for us. He's two pounds, 11 ounces. Okay, I don't know, if, is that gonna help us? Yep, our smallest fish right now is two, three, so that's a little bit of an upgrade. All right, we'll take it, every ounce counts. Get my brand new Skeeter all rigged up for the tour season here, and so excited about what Lithium Pros has got going on. Those are the lithium batteries that are running my bass boats now for several years. They would, could not be more happy 
lightweight, fast charging, super powerful, very dependable. But what they've got new, which I cannot wait to try, is the brand new 215 amp hour. This is what I call the Megalodon cranking battery. The need for two batteries, no more guys. You can put this battery right here and run all your electronics and your boat no problem all day long. And the best part about this battery right here, it is all NEMA 2000. So this is gonna be hooked up to my units. My Garmin's will tell me what, what state of charge I'm in. This is really, really great. So very good technology here on this battery. And the same thing with my control motor batteries. I have a 36 volt control motor battery and it also hooks up to NEMA. So when I get this boat finished, rigged out, it's gonna give me all the data that I need to know right there on my Garmin screens, which is awesome. Let me show you how I had this thing set up on my boat. I have both of my 36 volt control motor batteries right here, parallel together. You know, you don't necessarily need two of them, but life on the road, all the tournaments that I do, I like to have a second one just for those super long days on the water. Then I, of course, have my cranking battery over there. As you can see, I don't need two of them. That's the 215 amp hour cranking battery. That's the old style, but cannot wait to get the new one put in here, get all my NEMA hooked up, and again, have all my data right there at my fingertips on my Garmin unit. So for more information about all of the Lithium Pro batteries and all the technology they have, be sure to check them out at lithiumpros.com. There you go. Got yes, it. yes, yes. Got it a little weird, what do you think? Here, let me get him, let me get him. Oh, God. Got him, dude. That one will help. Yes, it will. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. We needed that. We needed that bad. We've been stuck on the two pound train for like, forever. That is a 320. 320. All right. 320. Well 320. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Again, nice right. picture at the end of the day, dude. Nice job. Nice job. So that's a new bait. I mean, that's well, the coolest thing about that bait, the Love Grub, is it is really made as a trailer. But we've adapted to flipping it. We did it yesterday in another lake, and it's working. Obviously, it's working great today. Catching some good fish, and uh, it's pretty cool, dude. I would too. I use the. Oh, I missed him. Oh, I missed him. Yeah. Oh, no, I still got him. Oh, you still got him. him. I still got him. Is he good? Him. Is he big? I don't think so. He's still on there, though. Yeah, uh, I, can, I can reach down there for you, but if Find out what we, we got. Where he is. Um, okay, follow the grade now. Yeah, oh, oh, it's big. Is he big? It's big. He's big? He's oh, big. Oh, oh. See if you can get him. Bro, oh, it's so stuck. Oh. Did you get him? No, not yet. Oh, shoot. He's giant. It's is big. He? It's big. Is he big? <laughs> All right, not as big as I thought, but that might It'll help, help. A bit. I think it'll help, yeah. Yeah. Dude, that was crazy. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Woo. I didn't think... Oh, well. I was about to... I didn't think I had her on. Oh, Three, oh he was on four. 315. Yeah, yeah. We'll take it. What does that put us so, at? That gives us another pound upgrade, so that puts us at just over 23 pounds, I think. Let's go. 23 <laughs> pounds, we're seven ounces. We're way towards that dirty 30, baby. Yeah. All right, last flip, dude. I feel like we got ourselves behind the eight ball on that big fish right off the bat, but... You never know, dude. All right, man, I, I heard you hollering and screaming like right off the bat, and then we got over here, and I heard more hollering and screaming over there in that other corner, so I know y'all jacked them up, dude. Hey, we, we got some fish, and our biggest fish of the day was our first fish of the day, so we were hyped right off the bat. Well, look, five fish limit. Yeah. We've got so many fish catches. You got so many fish. Let's just get to it. We're gonna, we're gonna see, what did your best five weigh? They weighed 23 pounds, seven ounces. We could not add hey, any fish. I think we got it. Yeah. 29.85. Oh my wow. gosh, he, they hit the 29.85. Hey, we're rounding that up to the dirty. No, hold on, hold on, I was just kidding, I was just kidding, okay, I'm just kidding. Okay, okay. I did a little math wrong. We only had 15.96, yeah. that means y'all win, dude. Oh, really? Y'all got it, dude. Go. There you had there us there. Go. I thought you guys had <laughs> us. We were getting nervous. You guys were looking a little bit confident over yeah, there. Hey, we that was only good had 16 pounds, dude. 16. Okay, yeah. hey. Mike, Mike, yeah. you, you got me, man. Hey. You got me. Appreciate Christian, it. awesome, dude. You're all going to be hearing about this for a while. Oh, I know. Thanks for having us on the show. It was a win-win for us, man. Yeah. Be able to hang out with you guys, do some great content, check some new baits, yeah. and nice. show everyone at home all the different things that we did. Like, it's going to be really interesting to watch this video to see how he flipped and what he was targeting, catch those bigger fish, all the things that we did, guys. Hopefully, you learned a lot about how to catch fish. Stay tuned. Next week, we're going to be on a whole new lake with a whole new challenge. Thanks for watching the Scott Martin Challenge, guys. We gone. We gone. Six pounder right off the bat, dude. What's up with that? <laughs> yeah, he backed it up, too. <laughs> yeah, what? He backed it up. <laughs>